on the world is phenomenal. According to MaryFisher.org, Mary Fisher started a CARE Fund, which stands for Clinical AIDS Research and Education Fund. Mary Fisher also started the Bracelet Project in Africa to help HIV-positive women make bracelets in order to sell them to have some sort of income to help make a living and pay for medication. Mary Fisher said that she would not stop fighting until there was a cure to this disease. This kind of dedication is what, breaks, what helps break down the barrier of impossibility. The light to her fire has never dwindled down. It has only raged into a massive force of possibility. <coughs> this amount of dedication is not one to ignore. It is one to admire. Merrick Fisher is an unthinkable woman with the support of millions. Today we have talked about Mary Fisher and her famous speech, A Whisper of AIDS. First, we examined her speech in peace to see how she portrayed her message. Second, we went over her personal tie to her speech and how impacted the speech. Lastly, we told you why we were inspired by Mary Fisher. We hope today you walk out of here with the understanding that clouded minds of the 80s. This is slowly deteriorating and partially thanks to Mary Fisher. But there are still millions out there who believe they're not at risk. We ask you, please, to look over at Mary Fisher's speech in its entirely and to think to yourself, are you ever asked? Thank you.